my name is Lizette from Yimfluence and in this video I'm going to show you how to practice a variation of child's pose. So it's called White Knee Child's Pose with a Twist. So this very mild twist is a pose that I often teach in my yin classes as it is very gently twisting our spine but it still gets you all the benefits from child's pose. So this deep relaxation, this inward draw, drawing the attention inward but it still has all the benefits from twist so by twisting we are actually doing lots of goodness for our bodies we are improving our digestive function we are detoxing our body allowing fresh blood to enter our digestive organs also releasing any build-up waste um, so that, that's very beneficial. Also, we are maintaining uh, normal spinal rotation and spinal movement. So it's very important to keep your spine flexible. Uh, also, uh, it can reduce back pains, but please make sure if you have any back injuries to always keep your knees below your hips in twists. So it's not for this type of twist, but um, if you do a double leg twist or just make sure that your knees are, are below your hips. And also in, uh, in twists, we are de-stressing. So if you suffer from anxiety or, or stress, it's very good to, um, to do a twist as we are opening our shoulders and chest and heart area. So um, we are giving lots of space to this zone. So let's get started. We're starting off on hands and knees, same as child's pose. Make sure to keep your knees above your hips. Hands are below the shoulders. And from here, you're gonna widen your knees towards the side of your mat, bring your big toes together. And you're gonna press yourself backwards. So from here, on the out breath, you're gonna stretch your left arm forwards. And then on the out breath, you are placing your arm and right shoulder down on the mat. So you can support your head on a block or you can place it down on the mat. So whatever serves your body today. If you suffer from any knee injuries, you can make this pose softer by placing a blanket underneath your knees. Um, if you feel too much pressure in the hips, you can also place a cushion underneath your bottom, underneath your buttocks. So from here, you're gonna place your, your body down, relax your head down on the mat. And you mildly stretch the arm out in front of you, very mildly. So you, you place, you try to place your, your forearm down on the mat. So really sinking into this pose, you feel the twist in your, in your spine, especially the upper back probably. So we're staying here for about two minutes. So make sure that you are comfortable. So to come out of this pose, you very gently press your hands into the mat, releasing your right arm and then walking your left hand back towards your body. And take a moment here to observe the difference between the two sides before you move on to the other side. So never forget to do the other side. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, then please subscribe to my channel and I hope to see you again soon. Bye.